Asus M5A motherboard, Cooler Master, Hyper T4, Cooler Installation. As you can see, this motherboard has these mounts. But instead of using those original, as you can see, they should be used like this, using those adapters, which came together with the cooler. Like you only to use those brackets then install them. We have all those necessary bolts. But instead of using all of those which came together with the cooler, I will use those mounts which I took from the motherboard which doesn't work. together with this which came together with this T4 cooler so let's remove those mounts from the board and install this one And from the other side, the same. Install the CPU. a brand new cooler so just remove this and install the cooler before you will install it don't forget to apply some thermal compound. Position the cooler. And lock it. Just like this. Don't forget to connect the CPU fan.
is how it actually looks when installed. Let's install it into the case. Just in testing purposes, let's install this old Atia video card. Connect the power. Actually, we need this as well. This was installation of Kipo cooler made by Cooler Master on this Asus M5A motherboard. And installation was done without being using those mounts that this cooler originally came with. I used mounts for the motherboard and replace the original mounts with the different one. Thanks for watching.